this is a special place. It, mm -hmm. It's uh, an apparent mess, but it's, in, it's, it's not a mess. It's uh, no. a, a sort uh, of uh, accumulation of uh, the history of the archaeology in Pompeii itself, isn't it? Yeah, uh, from the half of the 19th century, during the excavation, uh, clay vessels, amphora, transport containers were, uh, were uh, preserved here in the city, while the most important objects like statues or fresco went to the Archaeological Museum of Naples. Uh, so in these particular spaces we can see objects related to everyday life of ancient Pompeii. We can see, for example, amphora transport containers from all over the Mediterranean. We have um, amphoras, for example, from southern Spain, from, um, uh, from Gaul, from uh, Carthago, but also from eastern Mediterranean. We have a lot of amphora from Crete and also from southern Turkey. But also here we can see a lot of wakes that were used here because we are in the market, so they were necessary for market activities but also column capitals, the element of the, of the architecture and decoration of the forum that was under restoration at the time of the eruption. So it's um, partly a, a museum of the changing faces of the town. Yeah, uh, the objects uh, that we can see here are related mostly to the last phase of the city because um, the major part of the objects here were recovered by Mayuri who was one of the most important directors of the excavation from, the 20, from 1924 to uh, 1960, who excavated the houses south of Via della Bondanza. So what we can see here are the objects that were found uh, in the houses just before the eruption of 79 AD. So really a glimpse into the life of 79 AD. We have amphora from all over the Mediterranean, but we have also the amphora produced here in Pompeii, because we should remember that Pompeii was very important for the trade of wine, not a very precious wine, but uh, uh, wine for every day, <laughs> like, uh, the, the wine that you can use uh, not in a very important uh, banquet, but for everyday use. Uh, in fact, there is a famous uh, graffito in Pompeii that say, eat uh, bread from Pompeii, but don't drink wine from Pompeii, drink wine from Nuceria. So we have the amphora that were produced here and that circulated all over the Mediterranean, but at the same time we have the amphora with uh, uh, flat base that were produced in Pompeii, but used for the circulation along the Sarno River, because Pompeii, Strabo tells us, was the Epineion, that means in Greek arbor, of Nola, Nocerea, Cerra, that means that Pompeii was the gate to the Sarno Valley uh, and the interior um, places of Campania. Lastly, what are you going to do of this uh, peculiar place? Yeah. As you can see, this uh, exhibition is very old. This is because uh, the building was, uh, uh, was bombed in 1943, so we lost many objects, part of the pillars were destroyed. Then after the earthquake of 1980, there was this particular restoration. Now we are finishing a project of musealization. So this place will be a museum open to the public dedicated to the history of the forum, of the space, and also dedicated to the market and productive activities of the city. So um, here also you can see the seriality of ancient material culture. In the antiquarium you will see the masterpieces of Pompeii, the, the great frescoes, the silver, the statues, but here we, you can see the everyday life and everyday market activities.